Hello everybody, happy Sunday. So I hope you guys are having a great day today. Today is Sunday for me. It is November the 17th. So I want to first start this video off by showing you guys my flowers, how they have grown. Um, and then I'm gonna share a grocery haul with you guys. So um, I have these here, the, the this running vine here. I used to have this one right here and that one together, running together, but I decided to let this one just run down this way. And so as you can see, that one going that way all the way across and then this small one over here is coming up and you will see um it's not as full as this one and long i'm sorry guys long as this one but it is growing there and then of course i have this one and then this one here have grown so much started out with a little piece the one that's up here came from that one and even one that you see like this one, except for that one over there. But anyway, this one here, this one here, I got two of these. They started looking kind of, mm, I don't know, um, started coming up. These little spots started coming up on them. And then the leaves at the bottom started turning brown. They have stopped now. And so I asked my neighbor and good sis, um, Stephanie, and she said, Valenda, you may have rotten your roots by watering them too much. Because uh, right here, we get a lot of sun. As you can see, I got the blinds closed now. And you see, you can still see in here. But um, I stopped watering them for a while and just see if they will uh, come back. So they started growing new, new ones up here. But... Uh, some of them still have these spots. So I still have hope for those. This one here is a snake plant. It was uh, small. It was in a small pot. It used to sit on my island in this little pot here. But it started to kind of die down a little bit. And snake plants are very easy to grow. And Gary uh, said that uh, I needed a bigger pot. So... I did put it in a bigger pot, and as you can see, it's thriving. And then over here, I'm not sure what this plant is. I'm gonna soon have to repot it. It was smaller than this, and I put it in this pot. So I'm gonna soon have to put it in a bigger pot because it's, it's trees, you know, it's big. So I put a thing here to stand it up. As you can see here, I put that there, but I'm gonna soon have to repot that but that is beautiful i'm not sure what any of these plants call now this one here um i have two of this one and i gave my good my good sister in christ um shan one of those what i did was i uh I migrated i think that's what you call it, into another pot and and then I, um, you know, share that one. And I also have another one somewhere. I think I have another one. Because I, I had two big ones of these, and they died. And then uh, they was in my office, and I brought them in here to get a little bit more sun. And they thriving good. This one here um, is part of the big one over there. I need to find a name for them. But as you can see, I got the vine growing up there. And I got these little things here off of Shein. Now, uh, I should have put it like sideways like this one. It do better if you put it sideways, but this way they'll kind of come out. So, but I had another plant running vine, vine, <laughs> running vine, running vine here that I had on the floor. I also gave that to Sister Shein. But um, that one came from that big one. Then right here is the aloe vera plant. It don't take much at all to grow aloe vera. Um, you don't have to water them too often. So it's just been thriving. You know, I put it there. And then this fiddle fatta tree I've been having for years. I don't know what's going on with it. I had it over in that corner. It was fine. And then I move it over here. And then the leaves started drooping down. Um, 
as you can see, one of them fell off there. So I, I don't want to mess with it too much, but I really do think I need to put it in a bigger pot. And as you can see here, this little baby here, I had a, uh, I believe this is a, I, I, I thought it was a snake plant. I'm not for sure. Don't look like it. But anyway, it was in another pot and it was uh, dying, but the roots were still fine. So I just put it in here. And as you see, it's growing. So I pray that it continue to grow. And so I have this one. I had to repot it in a big one. As you can see, the leaves started turning brown. So I don't know. I know the seasons are changing. Uh, but this is a big, as you can see, it got a big, um, you know, stick on it. But I definitely don't want to oil over water and rotten it. Then I have this one. This is like a tropical plant. Um, I think uh, right here may be too much sun because y'all is like really warm right here. So I think I'm going to have to switch this one out and put the feather feather tree back here and move this one because as you can see, got leaves turning brown there. These two right here, they kind of died down, but I'm still have hope for those. This one here. Now the root, it, it was, I'm hoping that the roots will start back growing. That's why I just left here. I had to put in another pot. It was in a two little pot. This one part of the big one there. Um, I have this one here. It's related to this one over here. But these leaves are a little bit smaller and they uh, more greener, but they are related to this one here. And then this one is the other one to that one over there. And as you can see, the leaves turning brown. But I see something growing right here. I don't know if that's part of that or not. I'm not sure. And then over here is another one, the big ones that I have over there. I repotted that one and this one. It was a little bit of pot and I repotted this one. But now it look like I need to put them in a bigger pot. And then I have this one here. I just set her up here and um, she started turning a little brown too. So I'm hoping that it's because the season changed, y'all. I don't know. Um, and then over here, I have another fiddle feather tree. And some of the leaves starting to turn like this. So I'm thinking maybe it's the season. Um, but that one over there, I've been having a long, long, long time. I got it at Lowe's years ago. This one here was given to me, I think, my sister law funeral. I think that's what this one from. So I got that one sitting there. It don't have to have a lot of light, but it want a little light. And then over here, yeah, I have to excuse things. If you see stuff laying around, I'm cleaning. This is the big tropical plant like the other one. Now, I had it in my office, and it thrived. Uh, but I moved it in here. And as you can see, my leaves are turning brown. So I think I'm on, it's real heavy. I think I'm going to put it back. Because it's, as you can see, this is my living room. The windows are open, and there's just no sun in here. Now, if I turn this light off, I mean, it's just dark in here. No sun shine on the front of my house at all. And so it's really hard to grow plants in this um, in this room here, in my living room. And so, uh, but I think I'm going to move that one back to my office. And then I have a few of them in my office, but I won't share them with y'all because I need to clean. I got stuff like everywhere because... Um, I'm just transitioning uh, a lot of things to the new season. Then also, I am um, got a lot of stuff for yard sale. So, but y'all, since this video is nine minutes long, I'm just gonna let this video be a plant video, and um, and then I do another video with a grocery haul. How about that? All right, guys, thank you so much. I love you with the love of Christ, and I'll see y'all soon in another video. Bye, guys.